What's up, whiskey fans, and welcome back to another review video. In this video, we'll be looking at something new to our South African shores. And yeah, let's cue the intro and let's get into the video. Folks, welcome back to another video. Now, I don't know if this is a new entry to our South African market, but it is the Jamison Triple Triple. Now, as you can see, it is a lot different to this Triple Triple. Now, what we can see, the difference is obviously this one is a travel exclusive duty free one liter bottle and has been matured in sherry bourbon and malaga casks whereas this one has been matured in bourbon sherry and chestnut casks so a different cask but a different bottle so let's put this one away because this one is a bit of an expensive bottle and this one is a little bit of a cheaper bottle <laughs> this one is 43 percent it will cost you roughly only around 440 to 450 rand very close to the normal jamison in the stores and probably around about i would say in the dollar region what would I say in the dollar region? Probably around about between $25 and $30. So, not badly priced. As, again, it is a 750 ml bottle. They have moved away. Obviously, it's not a travel exclusive, so it's not a one liter. But, very curious to see what this tastes like. I walked into a Norman Goodfellas, which is a chain liquor store or bottle store here in South Africa. And I saw it advertised all over the shelf. So I thought, well, what better way this is but to give it a review. As all of you know, I am a Jamison nut. Anything Jamison, I go crazy over. So, yeah. The one thing I don't like about this bottle, and I guess it comes down to price point, is that it has a foil lid. But we don't mind about the outside. We mind about what's inside the bottle. As I said, this is triple distilled in three casks, making it a triple triple bourbon, sherry, and chestnut casks. Now, I'm excited to taste the chestnut cask side of things. It says velvety notes of toffee, cacao, and toasted almonds with an extra drop of smoothness. So, yeah, let's taste it. I prefer a cork pop. Than a breaking of a foil seal. Jamison, you hear me? Get a cork in this bottle. <laughs> the first thing you get is definitely a sherry influence. It just, just pops right out there. That fruity, dried fruit. Smells like a like an orchard. A little bit of burnt oak there on the nose. A little bit of sort of like a like a farm. If you go to a farm and you go through the fields, you walk through the fields, you get kind of that like that smell. That sort of reminds me of. But definitely, I do get like this weird, I think the almonds are, that almond sort of light nuttiness on the nose. But yeah, cheers. Wow. 
Jamison just doesn't disappoint on that smoothness. That triple distilled smoothness is just, it's unmatched. It's, it's amazing. <laughs> Again, on the palate, you definitely get that dried fruit, those dried peaches, dried figs, dried dates come through there. It has a sort of medium lingering finish, which makes it really, really easy to drink neat. And there's just a, I know I'm going to sound biased, but it's just a great tasting whiskey. I think with a little bit of, I think in a cocktail, I think this thing would be absolutely amazing. Just add a little bit more sweetness to it. I, unfortunately, when it comes to whiskey, I do have a sweet tooth. So I love those florally, fruity, sort of summery flavors. That's the one profile I go to time and time again for, for whiskeys. But this is just, this is nice. Sort of like a lemon or, or, or orange peel sort of notes there coming through. Not too pungent on the flavors, but they are subtly there. I don't know if it's because I've just cracked open the bottle. We haven't given the bottle time to breathe, but... The smoothness is just uncanny. As you know, it is Jamison, so it is an Irish blended whiskey. And I can't actually fault this one. Only the fact that it has a foil lid. It would have been better if it had a cork, but hey. Just saying. But this is actually a really, really nice whiskey. I think this would go fantastically with a some sort of a mixer or like I said, in a cocktail. But a, a great for the price point. Hey, you can't go wrong. And that is the Jamison Triple. Triple, like I said to you guys, I don't know if this is purely for South African markets or is something being released worldwide. I haven't done much research on it because I literally just got it today. So I will look into it and hopefully bring you more information about it. So yeah, Jamison triple triple. Guys, thanks very much for watching. It's because of you that I'm able to bring you the wonderful whiskies of the world. So please, if you haven't subscribed, hit the bell notification so you can see when a new video comes out. And I look forward to seeing you in the next one. But until then, drink responsibly. Cheers for now.